Hello guys and welcome to the Hive Production. In this video tutorial, we are going to model a FIFA World Cup logo in 3D Studio Max. During this session, we will play with some editable poly, some modifier of twist, video lighting, video materials and video renderings. So let's get started. First of all, I have a 3D Studio Max and I have these four viewports. First of all, I'm going to go to the uh, cylinder and I'm going to take the cylinder tool and first of all, I will draw the cylinder from the front viewport which has 60 sides. So it's going to be pretty smooth. All right, I'm going to go to the converting into editable poly. I'm going to take polygon and delete these extra polygon because I only need some edges. So first of all, here I have edges. So moving our next step and the next step is just going to find out twist modifier in modifier list. Here's a twist modifier I can twist from in every angle from X, Y, Z. So let's take this angles from the Y axis and now it's going to be twist perfectly from the left viewport side. So I'm going to select the gizmo of twist and will adjust according to the adjustment of logo. After adjustment, we will find out in the left viewport, it looks like the logo of FIFA World Cup properly. So we just need to set them. And after setting them, I'm going to maximize left viewport. Here it is the modifier list and I will find out the modifier which is called shell. Shell actually used to create a depth in it so it will be helpful. After doing this, we will convert into editable poly and select the edges from the both side. And now we will add two connections so by pressing connect we will have some two connection and by the help of scaling we will have some curve shape in it so now we will apply mesh smooth modifier to create some smooth look so here it is i have the basic model structures of the fifa logo now i'm going to go to the material editor and i will apply the material of fire and will set according to the alignments so let's go to the import material because in the adobe illustrator i have already have designed some calligraphic elements some florist elements and another thing that i have already designed fifa world cup qatar 2022 logo in the illustrated form so i'm going to import them first of all artwork so here it is i have uploaded my artwork i'm going to scale it so you can see this so this is my artwork i'm going to rotate and will adjust according to the position of this logo so just uh, adjust in front of this scale it up the size and with the help of rotation, with the help of scaling and with the help of position. So just go to the modifier list and we'll find out extrude modifier. Extrude modifier will help you to create the depth in it. And uh, when you will create the depth in it, so just uh, adjust this step according to the alignment of logo. That's perfect. So what am I going to do? I'm going to convert them into editable poly and after taking editable poly, just go to the polygon settings and select this one. Increase the size for the scaling according to the alignment. And after that, just go to the options of editable poly and find out detach. Detach which help you to make it separate. So by the help of detachment, you can adjust them separately on the logos. So just according to the rotation according to the position or a scaling from every angle you can see this now it looks good so the turn of this logos once again select polygons make it detach 
and adjust them separately. Treat the extra segments which we don't want because it's a rotational process so it will be rotated according to the behind of this object. Now this part, last part which is this. So just adjust, adjust this as well. So now we will, it's up to you that how to use this throughout the rotation, especially the rotation because the logo is in curved shape so you need to rotate according to the angles of this object. So finally we have done this uh, and we have some little problems so we just need to adjust. Somehow now it looks good. Done right there. Okay, so we just need to go to the editor of material and we will apply material editor. Now going to the Adobe Illustrator once again and we'll find our FIFA World Cup. So import the FIFA World Cup file as well in it. And the same process, just to scale it down, rotate the logo and adjust in front of the logo. And apply, apply a modifier from the modifier list. And the modifier is called extrude modifier to create the depth in it. Go to the editor of material and apply white material in it. So now I'm applying light because I'll have to take out the renders. So after applying the light, just select the light and uh, duplicate the light from the front side. We have placed the two lights and now we can see the render of this object. So right guys, I have just saved this logo as a PNG file. I'm going to go to the Photoshop and I will find out my render of PNG and I will adjust this render on the background of official FIFA World Cup. Let's see how it will look. And I hope you like this tutorial and if you like this, so subscribe my channel and press the bell icon. Thank you so much.